Thiago Silva went under the VAR microscope during Chelsea's trip to Crystal Palace on Saturday afternoon. The Blues made the infinitely tricky away journey to Selhurst Park for Graham Potter's first Premier League game in charge and it's fair to say that they didn't have everything their own way in South London. Despite Patrick Vieira's Eagles not actually having been as stellar this season as most people seem to think, they nevertheless flexed their muscles against their capital neighbours in the first half. A seventh-minute strike from Odson Edouard to silence his doubters was enough to make Chelsea realise that they were going to have to dig deep if they wanted to take any points back to Stamford Bridge. Thiago Silva's handball versus Palace And at one point, their task looked almost impossible as the Palace fans and countless viewers watching on from home thought that Thiago Silva should have been sent off. The legendary Brazilian centre-back had stopped Jordan Ayo from racing through on goal with what proved to be an incredibly cynical, obvious and deliberate handball. The feeling was, understandably, that Silva had used unfair means to prevent what could have been a critical goal-scoring opportunity for the home side. Palace chairman fumes on Twitter. However, despite VAR wading into the debate by looking at Silva's intervention in granular detail, the decision was taken that he should be awarded a yellow card as opposed to a red. But try telling that to thousands of incensed onlookers with even Palace's chairman, Steve Parrish, venting on Twitter, honestly what is the point of hashtag VAR we chop and change every week what it does what it thinks. Hashtag VAR must surely think that's a red but not a clear error. Even if it's not a hashtag dog so which it is he handballs it twice deliberately, one we play on so two yellows. Hashtag CPFC hashtag Apple. Be sure to check out the incident for yourself to work out what punishment you would have given. Why wasn't a red card given? Kmal explains. Now, as prevalent as refereeing errors can be in the Premier League, rest assured, as hard as it might seem sometimes, that all decisions are taken with a great deal of thought and consideration. And while there's nothing wrong with thinking that Silva should have been sent for an early bath, the case seems to be that the officials didn't think that there was a denial of a clear goal-scoring opportunity, Doxo. The message from Kamal as relayed by Molly Hudson of the Times went as follows, referee slash VAR after review believed it was not an obvious goal-scoring opportunity as still 40-45 yards from goal and two Chelsea players within 5 to 10 yards.